Hey y'all, good morning. It is about 7.30 in the morning and I have a new product to share with you guys. I have some patio lights and I do wanna go ahead and hang these up really quick before it gets too hot outside. I am in Georgia and it gets hot really, 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 really early here. So, But I wanna go ahead and hang these up really quick and I'll be bringing you guys along while I hang up my new lights. Before we get started, I did wanna show y'all what I'm using to hang the lights up. I got this from at home. Hopefully they work. I've never had patio lights before, so this is all new to me. But yeah, let's get started. These lights are ideal for gardens, balconies, gazebos, and more. The lights are durable and waterproof. They can withstand snow, sun, sand, and rain. They can also be connected to eight to 20 light sets. They are heavy duty wires and anti-drop plastic, making them sturdy and shatterproof. The light bulbs have an attached hook for each light bulb, making installation easy and quick. They were pretty long for this space, which turned out to be a great thing because I was able to achieve a more full look. The lights are absolutely beautiful during the evenings. It is a warm white tone and compared to other lights, these can save you more than 90% on electricity bills for outdoor lighting. Now that my lights are hung and looking amazing, I'm going to enjoy a glass of juice. I didn't do wine this evening. I had just some juice because I had other things to get done. But thank you so much, Oni, for sending me over your patio light set. If you are interested in purchasing these stream lights, click the link down below and use the code to save 20% off until September 20th. Oh, all right, y'all. So yesterday, my sister and I, we did a little bit of shopping. Um, I show a few clips right now. This one is nice, but I think my kids are gonna tear it up. It's like a brown. These are really nice too. And I was looking at these vases, but I don't like that shine on it. And then these look like genie bottles or something. I do like these mirrors. And they're on sale. The black one is nice. Let's make a home, be all alone. So tell me, baby, where would you like to go? All right, so with like fall decor and stuff like that, because I don't really have much furniture, I'm really not buying that much. And I've just been decorating here and there. I did a little bit here in the kitchen on the patio, just a little splashes. I did decorate a little bit on the front porch. I'll probably show y'all that. I don't know, man, because I haven't even cleaned the front porch. So I did share a few things in the buggy. You guys saw a little bit. But I just got stuff here and there. Um, I do plan to do a little bit of organizing in the pantry probably sometime this week. I went with this color and then I also went with black wood. I am going to add a little bit of plastic too probably but not much. So I got these. I think I already shared these with y'all on one of my vlogs but this is the tone I'm going for in the pantry. The pantry renovation probably will not happen <laughs> until probably next year sometime. 
or the year after that, I don't know. But it's not happening right away. We got bigger problems to deal with besides this pantry. So um, I'll just go ahead and organize it with the wire rack, but I do plan to change that up. But I ended up getting two of these for, I plan to use these for my potatoes and my onions. And they are stackable and these are from TJ Maxx in a $9.99. Also got also got like some fake Birkenstocks and then I got a size nine and a half. I'm normally like a ten and a half. This depends on the shoe and I guess these run big but these fit so good. And then I got a shower squeegee. I got Kobe another brush. These were 20 these are $29.99. Squeegee was on clearance for $3 and Kobe's brush was $4.99. I also got him some training pads. That boy will not go outside. I don't know what it is, but I got him from Petland. So he is used to peeing inside of a cage and he is so hard to break him from that. He just won't pee outside, y'all. So if you got any tips, please let me know. But I got him some training pads. These were, I think, six. $9.99. I also got some more cleaning supplies on, I think the video, before this video, I cleaned this hood and I got some cleaner, some stainless steel cleaner. Hopefully it'll get it clean like I want it. But the Wyman stainless steel cleaner, got that from TJ Maxx and it was $4.79. Then I got some of this Zelp Toilet Stain Eliminator. And then I got this one. This is like a different kind, but it's supposed to do the same thing. I just want to see which one works. But I don't know, y'all. I don't know about that. I don't know. I gotta hopefully the hopefully this will get those stains out of the toilet. I also got this vase from TJ Maxx. Um, I don't know where I want to put this vase. More than likely, um, I just realized I got two cream bases. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Well, this is like, almost like a little genie thing. But this one was $24, $24.99. I don't know where I'm gonna put it. I don't know yet. I don't know. Um, I also got some hand soap for the sink right here. And this is pumpkin spice. It's by Aroma Aria. Aroma Aria. And I just like the color. The color, the aesthetic, it's just so, it's just so pretty. It's just so nice, so pretty. So I'm just going ahead and put that on my sink. And then from Kirkland, I ended up getting this large vase. I do plan to put this vase on my, coffee table whenever I get my sofa. Hopefully they call sometime this week, y'all, and we have a sofa this week, because I'm so tired of sitting in these foldable chairs. I, oh. Anyway, I got this vase from Kirkland's. It was $59.99. I think it was 30% off, so it was $41. And it's like a rather large vase. I got these stems from World Market. I just want to see if they look right inside of the vase. I hate when this happens. I gotta find where it fell off from. So yeah, I'm gonna put this on my coffee table. I ended up getting these pillows. I don't even know when, but this is one. I love the texture of it. Like it feels really nice. And then the back is like almost linen. And then this is, it's not like Sherpa, but I don't know. It, it just feels really good, but that, and then I got two of these pillows. I'm actually using one on my bed right now. And um, yeah, so that's the look for fall. Minimal. Um, let's see. This one was 20, oh, this one was $19. And this one was $19 too. No, this one was $25. But like I said, I got two of these. 
We just need a couch. So Ashley, whenever y'all feel like it, just, you know, drop my couch off. We waiting. We are waiting. And then I also got this pumpkin. Like I said, I bought this stuff probably a month ago. I don't even know when. But whenever I see something, I just grab it. There's $12.99. This is so cute. I just love the texture. I would definitely put this on my fireplace. I think that's where I'm about to put it. And then I got another little pumpkin. And I think this one, yeah, this is from Hobby Lobby. And I wanna say this was the only one that they had. The only one, so I'm gonna put these on my fireplace. That, like show. All right, and what else? I got these little bins for the kids. Probably myself too, because I'm just, we're still living out of suitcases. So I'm just tired of having to look for underwear, socks, um, yeah, underwear and socks. So I bought these, and then for myself too. So I bought these for our underwear and socks. Now, um, of course, I'll probably end up just putting them all in somebody's room. I'm not sure either Landon's, Travis Jr.'s. But for now, that's what I'm using that for. And these were on clearance. They are originally $14.99. And I want to say I got them for $3. $3, I think. I think that's it, y'all. That's it for the haul. I'm probably about to eat real quick. I got to do some editing. I got a video going up tomorrow. So, um... I'm gonna do some editing real quick. I might upload it today. Not sure. I'm not sure. It might go up today, it might go up tomorrow. And um, what else am I doing today? I need to go grocery shopping. So much to do. It's always so much to do. But I'll be back, y'all. I'll be back. All right, so now it's time to do a deep clean in the master bathroom. It was a hot, filthy, dusty mess. And I did clean in here when we first moved in, but I didn't like do a full deep clean. And I promise y'all, it took about probably 45 minutes just to do the blind. So I won't be sharing the whole blind cleaning but it was ridiculous and i actually used some wall cleaner i think it's by zip to clean the blinds but they were just so dusty and filthy and oh my goodness the glass i am just convinced it was a fire my mom was saying that she if they were smokers maybe they smoked in the house but i don't i would have you know you can smell smoke so i don't know where this residue is coming from i know the last time i said something you guys told me it was mold but i highly doubt it's mold i don't know what it is it, i think it was smoke like maybe a candle was burning or something i don't know but look at it ridiculous this dirty like I had to stop y'all because huh there is no way
So I just wanted to stop and, you know, thank you guys so much for clicking on today's video. I truly appreciate the love, the support, the comments, the likes, the gifts. I truly appreciate all of you. If you are new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you are a new subscriber, welcome to the family. I am a military wife and a mom of three. We currently live in Georgia. We just moved here. We just purchased this home. And as you can see, it is a hot mess. So I'll be doing tons of cleaning. I'll be making this house a home. I hope you guys enjoy the house updates. I have more to come this week. The schedule was a little off because I was waiting for like a few brands, but we um, are trying to upload two videos a week on this channel. I will, don't think I will be back over on my vlog channel just because it's just been a busy, busy, busy season in my life. And I truly thank God for everything he has done and what he is continuing to do. I Oh my God, I am just so blessed. My family is so blessed. My kids, I'm just just so thankful and so grateful at this time of my life, even though I moved into chaos, but at least I have a house over my head. This is our very first purchase. So I thank God for allowing us to become first time homeowners. So yeah, and I truly thank you so much for choosing me to watch today. If you are still here and watching leave me some sponge emojis in the comment section it's never over till it's over baby yeah. i've been thinking about you I did discover quite a bit of mold down here at the bottom. I'm not sure what's going on with that, but I sprayed it with some Tylex. And I also noticed a lot of mold underneath like the bench part in the shower, but I got it clean as best as I could. I got a lot of it like gone and removed. 
I don't know if that's, I don't know. But y'all, we're going to stay on top of that because if you remember the house in Germany with all that mold everywhere, that bathroom was, oh my God, it was so hard <laughs> to deal with that bathroom. The mold just kept coming back. It was crazy. So hopefully we don't have all that going on in this bathroom. I also made sure to wipe down all the baseboards, the walls, everything, everything, y'all, because it was hair, dust, everywhere. So, yeah, before I get the comments about the air filter, working on it, y'all. <laughs> I'm working on it. My to-do list is so long, like it's so long. It's like never ending. And also, Travis, his to-do list, when he come back, is long as well. So. It's just a lot. It's a lot to take on. I appreciate the comments. I appreciate the advice you guys give me. Y'all, y'all tell me everything that I didn't even know I was supposed to be doing, but I'm figuring it out and I appreciate y'all for the love, the feedback, the advice, the tips. Thank y'all. I appreciate it. All right, so I'm all done cleaning in the bathroom. I turned the robot on and it cleaned the floor. Um, the shower is clean. I don't know if, like, I don't like the way that looks still. 
like I feel like I, I just don't I don't know what that is <laughs> I don't know it's like not even I don't know maybe it's a film or something yeah I don't know what that is but it's clean the tub is clean the sink the sink area is clean I still need to get up there and deep clean those bulbs the toilet closet is clean too I will be taking those down. 